When I was a child in Montana, my grandparents would come out every summer and they would camp out on this piece of land that they have. And I would stay with them for about a week. And uh, every night we would stargaze. I would sit on my grandma's lap and we'd look up at the sky and watch for shooting stars and watch for satellites going over and point out interesting things that were happening. It was one of those experiences that I'll probably remember for the rest of my life. I do have pretty much a full sleeve of tattoos, which you don't really see in a lot of uh, scientists. Um, it's essentially the Van Gogh painting, Starry Night. It's, it's my version of it. On my elbow I have uh, what's called Star Trails. I have the Aurora Borealis. I have Saturn. Saturn's my favorite, my favorite planet. I have Voyager 1 on here. I am passionate about space. I've been with SPOT for two and a half years now. Um, I'm a physics major, uh, that's my background. I'm a teaching option, so I'm looking to, uh, to teach physics uh, when I'm done with school someday. So SPOT, the Space Public Outreach Team, is uh, an organization that is indirectly funded by NASA, the National Aeronautics and Space Administration. So when we travel around the state of Montana, we give presentations to mostly K through 12 classrooms, so kindergarten through 12th grade. You go to these schools where there's 100 students in the entire K through 12 program, and we might be the only time that they're ever exposed to a space topic um, in their entire K through 12 career. It's really sad, but at the same time, if you go to one of these schools, and they never get that kind of experience. If you have a positive experience with at least one of those children, uh, that will stick with them the rest of their life. This presentation uh, that I'm going to give you today is called Life in the Universe. All right? So we're going to talk a lot about this thing right here. I mean, I've only got 12, 12 high schoolers and nine junior hires, so I really get to know the kids really well, and I get to see them progress over time, which is really great. I think SPOT is a great opportunity to open up the, the, the viewpoint that these kids just aren't seeing. Two possibilities exist. Either we are alone in the universe, or we are not. Both are equally terrifying. Kids need to be interested in space, so if we added more curriculum to the space science, I think they'd see, they'd see the world is a lot larger than they think it is. You know, it's hard when you're living in such a small community to think outside the bounds of this community, but when you see the space science, you see the Hubble telescope taking pictures, you know, hundreds of light years away, it's amazing the enormity of the universe. So I think it really, really, gets kids interested and really gets them uh, excited about the world. SPOT is kind of that bridge uh, between the hard sciences and uh, the average person. The reason why space science is so important is because it really is the cutting edge. It's, it's, uh, it's the frontier. Leaving the earth and going somewhere else, uh, that accelerates progress in in a very profound way, but it also makes our subjective human experience better.